One of the biggest shopping days of the year. In fact, welcome to Black Friday. Tens of millions of Americans will be hitting the malls today, and the rush is already on this morning. Americans expected to spend about 11% more this year than they did last year. That's good to hear. You're looking at a busy Best Buy. Shoppers door busting at these early hours. It's a scene playing out across America. Coming up, we're going to help you strategize with a look at some of the best deals out there on this Black Friday. Yeah, we have some great tips for you. Already America's annual bender of consumerism has turned ugly in a few spots, however. Police making arrests. There's fights over these doorbusters out there, Dan. Quite a bender, as you said. Uh, <laughs> let's kick off our coverage. We do have team coverage this morning. We've got Becky Worley standing by in San Francisco with a look at those deals, but we're going to start with ABC's Rebecca Jarvis at the Best Buy here in New York City. Rebecca, happy Black Friday to you. Happy Black Friday, Dan. Nice to see you. And I think it's safe to say, and not everybody's going to like this, but Thanksgiving Thursday is the new Black Friday. Here at Best Buy, they opened their doors yesterday at 6 p.m., had people around the block waiting to get in, and it was the same scene at stores around the country. Junior! Tis the season hey, hey, hey. to be not so jolly. Chill, Around the nation, wild scenes as frantic customers were determined to snatch up some of those jaw-dropping Thanksgiving Thursday deals. Watch the man in orange as he wrestles his way through a crowd at a North Carolina Walmart. Another unruly shopper tackled by police. Bullets flew outside this Coles in Illinois. Multiple injuries reported after an alleged holiday robbery ended in a shootout. Hey, taste some, bro. A brawl broke out in this California Walmart parking lot where more than 3,000 people were waiting to get in. And in Southeast Texas, an altercation over electronics. And it was a big old brawl. I guess they got kicked out or whatever, and they didn't get the TVs anyway. But from coast to coast, most scenes were just eager shoppers enjoying early store openings in a frenzy of big time savings. This is perfect. It has 100 pieces for 10 bucks. You can't beat that. Early bird Kmart customers flooding in at 6 a.m. Thanksgiving Day. Enjoy. Whoa, whoa. At the 5 p.m. opening of Toys R Us in New York City, checkout lines were packed in five minutes. Whoa. 8 p.m. shoppers swarm J.C. Penny, and this was the scene at Macy's. Doors and wallets opening wide on Black Friday Eve. Sorry, take care. Several Walmart stores hitting their peak capacity, further agitating those enthusiastic shoppers. And no issues here at Best Buy to report. They've had to send people in and out in waves. That's how busy things have been this morning. The big sellers are the tablets, those iPads, those flat screen televisions. Those, Biana, are the big, big doorbuster deals that everybody's been walking out with today. All those hot electronics. All right, Rebecca, thank you.